Actual Finish the Podcast. We back at it again. I usually don't try to keep up with the episode count, but very recently I think I became aware we were on episode 33. So that's kind of a monumental number a lot of times. Got a special guest, been pretty viral in these recent weeks. My home boy <laughs> and my five fingers voice. Spotty face, little turtle, um, man of many names. I heard him shout out a few more handles the other day. Welcome to the podcast, bro. Pleasure, pleasure. Um, you know, I know. Uh, I, I know it's kind of hard to just. You have some bad news, bro. I don't, don't want to um, skip by it, but out of respect, I don't want to try to bring you into the conversation of it. But you shared some bad news with me on your way here, so I just want to send my condolences. Very recently, I've become very familiar with the closeness of how death can be, man. So my condolences to you, that man, to be, I almost was like, damn, should I tell the homie not to come? Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So I just wanted to do, send that to you on behalf of myself and the staff here too. Appreciate that, man. Me and my family appreciate that. And the announcement of the loss, it, how recent has it been? Just like 48 hours ago, yeah, I, yeah. I, I, I lost one. Unfortunately, I lost my little brother. Oh, to That's the just, uh, to the streets. To the streets, man. To the streets. So, so, well, I'm just want to, like I say, send your condolences, rest in peace to your brother, love and respect to him. This is Facts with Feelings, episode 33. Just wanted to get out that out the way. You've been um, shit for the lack of a better word. You've been kicking ass on the internet lately. You've been everywhere. It's like overnight. People, everybody's familiar with you. And I know controversy sells. Yeah. Uh, you've heard it all at this point with all the controversy. Some people tend to think you might be chasing clout. I know you're pushing a lot of principle. Um, I don't want to hash nothing old that has already gotten settled because I know you let me know in conversations offline a couple of days ago that the back and forth with the negativity between you and Brick is matured beyond what the most of us of, of us have seen. Yeah. So I don't want to go back, but um, I do want to question you about this. Yeah. There's been a very recent video of a phone call that was recorded. Uh huh. And and just in general, I just want to get it from your perspective. Do you believe that was a spotty thing to do to record that phone call? I do. And expound, please, because you know. I mean, um, some would think not. Yeah, I really don't care, but you know, um, like in certain situations, I believe in like protecting yourself, like you know what I'm saying, like your imagery, you know what I'm saying, your your principle, everything. You get what I'm saying. So my whole thing is, I I never even I never even um a lot of people you know what I'm saying thought it was me, like Cub had called I mean D Jack had called him on three way. You get what I'm saying, and me and a homie. Lil EC Blaze, we was already flicking it up. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you see, I had the same, you know, on my page, I had the same outfit on or whatever the case is. So me and Cub was taking flicks and we was already taking videos when I got on, Cub. And Cub, like, I put it on speaker. You know what I'm saying? The little homie or whatever, he cut automatically. So I did, you know what I'm saying? Like, cut automatically, you know what I'm saying? Start going up. So, I, I, you know what I'm saying? Eventually, I seen him, but you know what I'm saying? I didn't tell Cub, like, you know what I'm saying? Or whatever the case was, but I'm glad he did. For the simple fact is, you know what I'm saying? Me and uh, me and a homie, you know what I'm saying, we break, we had came, at least I thought we came to a um, common ground, you know what I'm saying, or to or the conclusion, you know what I'm saying, we was gonna meet up a little later after he bust his play or whatever, you know, and um we was gonna hash it out. Whether like like I said, like I, you, you heard on the um on the conversation, whether it was, you know, us yeah. have a conversation, you know, whatever, whatever homies do, you know what I'm right, saying? Right. However however it was, I was gonna get a homie the opportunity, you know what I'm saying, right. to to do so. Right. The reason why I say like I'm glad that I um that it was recorded is because you know it was portrayed in another light. Like you get what I'm saying? We had you you heard the conversation, so it was like, all right, we're gonna leave it at this. But I, I was I was firm on my beliefs, like, bro, like this the only problem that I had with you. I understand what I did. You said well, I crossed the line, but I'm not gonna be one of these internet trolls or whatever the case is. I'm gonna give you action. I mean, we homies. However, you want to, you know what I'm saying? Right. Not even saying it necessarily has to, it had to be violent. Right. No, I, you, yeah. If you if you expounding, you doing it for them. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm following you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So so for the people that know that right. that's where we was at with it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But um. So 
when it didn't go as I I, I, I thought it was, like you know where I, I was raised, or how I was brought up, you know. You're doing this. Yeah, yeah. A man, a man, a man. You know, a man's word is his signature in his mind. When you say that, I'm back automatically. I'm thinking that's what it is. Right. You, you get what I'm saying? So I had left it alone. Three hours, maybe two, three hours later, my phone blowing up. Boo, 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 boo. You see with the voice. I'm like, what? Like, what you talking about? He posted a video, like, going in. Like, oh, ooh, 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 they can clout chasing and this, 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 and the third against everything that we had just discussed. And mind you, in the video, I'm telling you the whole time, bro, if it ain't up, it ain't up. I'm not, you know, I don't do, like I said, I just did 12 years in prison, bro. I'm not with the, I'm not with the games. Like, if it's right. not up, it's not up. I'm not about to have the world portraying, like, or, or us portraying to the world, right. you know, that it's a problem with me and you when it's really right. not. You get what I'm saying? Right. And me personally, I have no problem with saying, like, it ain't no problem, bro. Like, are we hashed it out? You know what I'm saying? So that's what that was. But he ended up coming out of video and, like, just going in, this, this, that, and the third, a lot of, disrespectful things that I, I felt so I'm like all right bro that's how you feel like we just had this conversation and then you know it came down a pipeline I had bro you know right. the, the mutual party get at him he like oh that was already um planned to come out or this this that it was on a timer I mean you know I don't be understanding none of that mm. so my whole thing is that that was a case bro it we happens, homies though. It, it does. Happens. It happens. It, 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 but let's say however it work yo yo however that work right you know what we just talked about right why not snatch it? You get what I'm saying? Right. That's your page. You run your page. Whoever run, hey, me and the homie, hey, cancel that. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? So that's when I like, all right, nigga, you you still trying to act like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And mind you, before it was already said, like, man, it's just a little internet game. I don't, you know, I don't know no games. Like, you know, right, I, right. I don't, I don't play the internet. So I'm like, what? Like, you know, and that, and that that's what fucked me up. So that's what I'm like, all right, you want to play like this? Because now you playing with my imagery, like now, now you playing with my name, like you and you calling me out by name and this, that, and the third, and you know, just, just so I'm like, all right, fuck it, then, nigga, you know. But at the same time, I do feel that that was petty. But at the same time, like I feel, I'm protecting myself, like I'm, I'm a, I'm a whole image out here. You get what I'm saying? So like, it, it don't make it seem like it's up or you just, you just doing this when in, in actuality you was on some humble shit. We both, we, we both was right. Not right. not saying because I wasn't getting at him crazy. I wasn't disrespecting him. I was talking to him, and I thought we had a. Um, yeah, from what I heard, the conversation was was pretty cordial. Yeah, yeah. So so first first and foremost, man, that's the homie. You get right. what I'm saying? So right. my my so as far as far as the homie, like you know what I'm saying. My first my first thing was the homie is to you know what I'm saying to for us both to get an understanding and what we want out of the conversation. You get what I'm saying? From an outsider looking in. The way that you guys have been able to start communicating and resolve that first bullshit, I can say I believe your aggression and certain choice of words probably caused it to go to a level it probably necessary wouldn't have went to had you just how we speaking now. Yeah. And made all those points you made about what you didn't like about what he did without using certain verbiage and calling certain names. I think the dialogue probably would have jumped off healthy. He would have responded more respectful, but I think when you would call this certain shit, Buster said Mark yeah. shit. But you know, yeah. whether technically you saw it like that, yeah. Once you get at a nigga like that, he gonna get on this, and then now we on a ride that is. You can make I some agree. sense. He can make some sense, but nobody's paying attention to that because we on this ride, and I think that's what really happened. I I, I agree. I, I I wholeheartedly agree, and then that's that's why I told him as well. It's like. You know, in, in recent days, like I haven't, I've, been, I haven't talked to him, like you know, what I'm saying since that phone call. But again, I've been on a campaign, like you know, what I'm saying, like I'm not t trying to change the narrative, right. like bro, like that's the homie, right? You get what I'm saying? I but appreciate he, he, you that for that, cause yeah, like you like, jumped off on the level where it was separating him. It was like a personal energy to where not that, and I know. If you was stern, but I kept saying, "Homie, that's the homie, that's the homie," and you wasn't really. And then next, I talked to you a week later. And now you saying it like that, so I salute you for even getting over whatever you was on, cause you wasn't really feeling like that at first. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't because at the same time, like the environment I came from and how I was raised, but also it's like, I'm just, man, bro, I just like the the image that I'm portrayed, like, like, uh, like they were like, oh, he cloud chasing, he doing this, he doing that. And if you don't know me, like if you from Wyoming or, or whatever you right. from Texas, or it might come off like that, but this everyday programming in LA, you get right. what I'm saying, but I, I just I just hate the fact that I got out of my own skin. I let my emotions, you know, get the best of me. 
It happens. You know what I'm saying? I, I let my emotions, and I, but look, I'm, I'm a man enough to admit that. I let my emotions, it, when, I, I still feel like I wasn't wrong, but I was wrong in a way, you know, in, 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 in a way that, that right. I said, you know, I'm, that's the homie. Right. I said, we should have handled that in house. So I'm going to be a man, you know what I'm saying? And, and acknowledge my wrongs. I shouldn't have did that. Like, you get what I'm saying? Because just how, as I'm on him, as he has a black big platform and perception is everything, by me being the status, I mean, the person that I am and having my status, you know, I shouldn't have said that because a lot of people going to take that as face value. They're going to take my word for it. Right. You know, they know when I say something, that's what it is. So, you know, as as being one of those people, you know what I'm saying, in the upper essence line or in a pecking order, you know what I'm saying, within our community, I shouldn't have did that. So that was my bad. I salute that, and, and I think that's a good um, note to leave that conversation on. We yeah. didn't get yeah, that was that was beautiful. I appreciate that. Yeah. While we was talking that, you mentioned uh, Deshaun Jackson. Yeah. Can you speak to how um, it is to have such a high profile homie that's so down to earth, that's accessible to you, that's there for you, but he still doesn't compromise what he's accomplished? How does that feel? to be able to have access to a homie like that? To be honest, it, it, it feel good. Like, you know, just just having somebody, especially somebody who I'm, I won't say I idolize, you know what I'm saying, because- uh, There's so many have. Yeah, 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 yeah you know, yeah. To, to the rest of the world, you know, right. that, and that's and that's only because of my, you know, my, my, my faith. Right. You feel me? I, okay. I believe, you know, it's only, it's only one most high, so I'm not gonna never idolize anyone, but as far as somebody who I, I love to death, like, you know what I'm saying, watching, right. you know what I'm saying, right. around the same age, like going, you know what I'm saying, NFL Hall of Famer, you know what I mean, my, not just saying that because he my homie, but my favorite wide receiver of all times, you know, being able to grow up with him and then now I'm out and seeing his dreams fruition, coming to fruition and me living through him in prison, you get what I'm saying? Oh. So it's, it's, I mean, it's, it's full circle, it's a full circle moment and it's, it's everything to me, you know? Did, did you was, did you have a hard time getting people to believe that you knew him like that when you was down or did you have, was it easy for you to show them that that's my people's? Nah, it was, it was, I mean, it was easy because all the people that he was around when, you know what I'm saying, he was, yeah. you know, th them my bros as well, but I'm not gonna make it seem like me and him had the best relationship, right. you know what I'm saying, when I was down, not saying we was beefing or anything but like just that. Just wasn't that tight, maybe. Yeah, 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 yeah. As, as far as like you know, what I'm saying the distance or whatever right. the case is, but that was definitely the homie. But now it's like that's why I respect him even more because you know what I'm saying. As soon as I get out, you know, this a real one. That's you right. know what I'm saying. But I mean, but it it was that that was there when I was inside, but I never utilized it. You know what I'm saying? The resources or you know me, I, I had my own right. motion, I had my own place. So you know, I was doing my own thing. But now that I'm out, it came to me like, look, bro, huh, 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 huh. And it's I can't say I can't. Besides my family, I, I can name probably on one hand how many niggas you know what I'm saying pull pull me like mm -hmm. huh bro like huh yeah. without without being have to you know what I'm saying like right. look nigga you know what I'm saying huh put this in your pocket right like you get what I'm saying yeah, don't you know, have to like it used to yeah and he and he did that for me and he don't know how much I appreciate that because he didn't, he don't owe me nothing he didn't have to give me nothing no nothing but by him acknowledging like this a real homie this a highly decorated soldier that's out you know what I'm saying like I don't care what nobody gave you or how much money you got now you know what I'm saying he he go little son put this in your pocket bro if I could do more you already know just hit me whenever you need something. That's and right. I appreciate that, bro. Salute to D Jack Jackpot for that, man. Yeah. That's 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 yeah, real absolutely. Easter on my behalf. Oh my mama, mama. Your cousin yeah. four extras went super viral. That's your cousin, right? Yeah, that's my that's my blood cousin. My first cousin. Our our our, our fathers is brothers. That's deep. How how does it feel to have a, a a family member that close and a comrade at the same time, my homie? Do y'all got a special bond that or is it just like not no big thing that it's your family member, he's just a homie? Like he definitely more than my homie, but I'm used to it because, like I said, we first cousins. Like our our daddies is brothers. Like we sleeping in the same bed. Like you know what I'm saying, sleeping at each other's house. You know what I'm saying. We thugging. I remember you know what I'm saying. We had the chirps together. We hopping on the Metro Link. You know what I'm saying. The Blue Line going to the you know what I'm saying. Going going to the hood. That's right. You know on the 105 to Vernon bus. So, you know um, yeah, it's it's, it's regular to me, but it's definitely a um a bond. You know. Me and him to always get along, you know what I'm saying? We we gotta go in the backyard sometimes too. We we brothers like you know what I'm saying? We cousins, that. but we more like brothers. We always don't get along. No, you guys have time. two very strong personalities, so yeah. I can imagine y'all bump heads. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but what what I what I do get what I get I do get to um uh, extras though when they do get serious, like 
he do know, like, man, you you my big cousin, like, you know what I'm Shalou. saying? He never disrespectful for, to the point, like. You know, I heard, I, I got an opportunity to witness y'all politic com conversate a little bit, and yeah. even talk to another one of y'all G homies, and the world wouldn't believe that extras knows how to like, just conduct himself like a man. He hit the yeah. scene so with the extras, yeah. people wouldn't believe that he can really just be a gentleman in, in, yeah. in politics. But yeah. Four extras is normal, y'all. He, he he like us. He yeah, regular. Yeah, oh, yeah. Baba Mama. Shout out to the homie, Nate Bud. Yeah, Nate Bud. Don't want y'all to be scared of him. I think he scared a lot of people. I think people were just scared of his energy. I mean, well, I'm I'm gonna just I'm gonna keep man, they were scared. I mean, you know, they 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 ain't never been around that. Uh, uh, another right. shark, a shark, like, listen, man. A shark or a lion ain't gonna be you know what I mean? Like we 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 oh God. we we respect the pecking order, but at the end of the day, like I'm a shark too. You 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 align as well. You know what I'm saying? Right. So you know anything beta, you know that's on them. But everything alpha, <laughs> I like how you put that. Yeah, you know we 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 we, you know we don't. That ain't nothing. That's normal to us. Did you have a relationship with Lupe before I got out or right or now? now? Oh yeah, absolutely. So what's the update on her health? Any update on her health? Oh, uh, she actually in re um, recovery right now. We praying for you, Lupe. Yeah, she getting stronger. So you know, after after the little mild stroke or whatever, she has to um, you know, go through the motions or whatever. You know, therapy and things. Mm -hmm. PT, physical right. therapy, and, and to get her her one of her little her sides back all the way. Mm -hmm. She's not far as gone as as it could have been way worse, bro. Hey, man, it could have been I way worse. I text you, Lupe. I don't know if you just down off your phone right now, but I, I text you some prayers. And I'm still praying for you, baby. Yeah. Yeah, and um, also with that, I'm, a, I'm, a, um, I had it in my, um, my story. I'm gonna repost it. You know, um, not saying that she, that that she broke or anything like that, but you know, anything to help for the medical expenses. Oh, yeah, and it's definitely. hard out here, man, and it's, yes. it's it's expensive, especially when you're doing it out of out of, out of your own pocket. Yeah. So I'm, I'm gonna have that up, um, as well. You know, go do donate to the, um, to the cash app or whatever, or hit her page directly and see how you can, um. You can help her, you know, with her medical bills. By the time this um, comes out, we might be able to have it flash on the screen. That'll be spotty. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my mama, mama. Um, how about Crip Mac? Any idea what the homie situation looking like? Well, when I holler at him, I really don't be hollering at him. Like, you know what I'm saying, about about that. You know, it just be passing. Like, what's up, bro? Keep your head up. You know, we got you out there, whatever the case is, you know. I don't really, I don't really get too political because you know he on he on that federality phone. That ain't a secure line, so I, I don't even be trying to say my name on there. You right. give, <laughs> nigga give him a couple oops and a couple woody woots. Right. You know what I'm saying? And I'm out of there. You know? Right. Can you just give the world your um, general overall thoughts on Crip Mac? People have their opinions. You have a reputation, mm -hmm. and you know I've connected myself to Crip Mac in a ways where I don't pass no judgment on him. So yeah. I'll explain why. I would just like to hear your perspective as to why you got love for Crip Mac. I got love. I, I got I got a lot of love and respect for Crip, Crip Mac because he didn't quit. Mm. You know, it, it was it was times. You know, like I said, I watched him in prison go viral. I didn't I didn't know Crip Mac personally. You know, right. when, when I was out or whatever the case is. But I seen his flaws. I seen his mistakes that he made. But he was man enough to stand on them. You get what I'm saying? Go go in that backyard, you know what I'm saying, and clean it up. A lot of people, when they deal with adverse situations or deal with, you know what I'm saying, any type of discrepancies or any type of backlash like that, they fold. Let me get up out of here. Now I'm not pulling up. When it was an issue, he pulled up. He knew what he had coming. So to face that head on, to me, that's that I respect about him. Everybody don't always start off strong like everybody mm. else do. Not saying that the homie never started off strong. My whole thing is everybody fuck up. Everybody mess up. Everybody sin. But nobody's bigger than, you know what I'm saying? We all men at the same time. Everybody fuck up. Everybody did some bullshit. It just probably some got caught and some didn't. Right. You get what I'm saying? So my whole thing is about is, I know a lot of people who started off strong. They on S&Y yards right now. Shh. I know a lot of, lot of, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people who killed 50, 50 people. You dig what I'm saying? They they went out bad. They didn't snitch. They didn't fuck. You know what I'm saying? Not not to try to justify, justify any yeah. any 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 frivolous bullshit that he might have did. But my whole thing is he stood on that. Like I, I fucked up. Like give me what I got coming. Right. And he still there. And he represent the homies, our community. You know what I'm saying? 
to the to the to the max, bro. He got right. the old school heart. That's what I love about him, the max. Like he right. got that eighties, that early nineties, mid nineties soul, early thought. You know what I'm saying? Like, like he, my khakis on in the spirit of crib max. Bro, you, you 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 gotta love him. If you a homie, yeah. you gotta love him, bro. Even if you from the other side, like man, I, I I don't I don't I don't get along with them dudes, but they got one. Yeah, I don't think as much as they might have initially. I don't think the orange boys hate him like that. I think they kind of take it like a. I think they kind of get it. I don't think they hate him. I mean, he wanted to run it in a system when they see him, but as far as out here thinking he top up, I doubt he's far from that. No, he definitely, he definitely, I'll disagree. Okay, you disagree? Yeah, I'll disagree. Let me stop before I forget. 1217 Entertainment, shout out my boy Kev, Tattoo and Danny. Stay tuned, big things coming. Go ahead. Yeah, I, I disagree because the homie been too, he he too viral. He been viral mm. for a long. He on for the homies, mm. and only that he put that on his forehead. So you know they like, even if you wasn't like that, you know how I be like. Right. He did. Yeah, you did, see that? Yeah, it's like yeah. He the nigga. He the nigga with the clout. He is a trophy. You right. He, he is, is a, a trophy. trophy. Yeah, man, he, 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 he face of a whole a oh, yeah. whole whole street. Fifty oh, yeah. fifth. Right. But then in the end car, he like it's on. Come top on, that's that, that. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying. That that's gonna hurt everybody. You yeah. know what I'm saying. So yeah, he right. he definitely a trophy. I saw recently. Um, it's like he relinked back up with Six Hundred. I think Six Hundred say he's gonna be his everyday uh, security when he get out. What you think about that? So I think it's dope. Good idea. Any 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 time two men can set aside their differences, you know what I'm saying, and come together and get get this money, get some of this money. You know what I'm saying. I I I, I think it's dope. I don't see nothing wrong with it. That's right. Salute to them, man. Hope that works out in both of their favor. Yeah, shout out 600 in and Crip Mac. Yeah, night boy. I seen you do some rapping, man. You still doing the rap thing? Or? I am. I, I'm not, but it's, it's like I said, I, I've been dealing with so much and so much, um, like I said, like even to adjusting, you know, adjusting in the world and, you know, being a father, you know, being a mm -hmm. brother. Like I, I lost my mom June, June 3rd last year. Three, three, three weeks before I got out. So I'm, mm. still, yeah, I'm yeah, so I'm, I'm mourning they over de that. They delayed the services so you can attend? They did. That's right. Yeah. Bless your, bless your mama heart. Bless her soul. My yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. Me and my family definitely appreciate that. So I'm still dealing with that. And then it's like the adjustment, you know, and then the, the, the overnight sensation, you know, all that. So it's like, I, I do that, but that just, it's crazy because it pushed me in another path. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It pushed, well, pushed me in, in a path that I really wanted to go right. faster than what I was, you know, than I was expecting. I'm trying to get a lot of conversation out before I get to what I really want to talk to you about. Mm -hmm. So I know people probably think I got Sporty Face here because Sporty Face blew up on some controversy and some bullshit. Yeah. On oh, my mama, you didn't been on the black box. Yeah. You've been in it and you've been on it. Yeah. I brought you here because I'm extremely impressed with some of the latest controversy you found yourself in that's not online. Uh -huh. And you know, I've heard the, about these type of programs for years and years. I find other people getting involved and it seems like it's always bigger than me and they know mm -hmm. this and they know that. Yeah. And for you not to know nothing other than there's resources available based on geographics. Yeah. And you feel like it should be some, you did some investigating and I'm just gonna summarize it, but I want you to tell the story after I summarize it. So. You were interested in tapping into what type of funds was available in your pro in your neighborhood, similar to the grid or the grid and things of that nature. Uh -huh. In the process, you talked to my G homie PP, mm -hmm. and he gave you the direction that maybe you need to holler at Big U. Yeah, you holler at Big U, and once you got that Big U, like, cause I'm trying to see what's happening with the forties. I'm under the impression that you got to say so with this bread and all that. Yeah, and he told you that's not so, and please tell us what took place from that point. Yeah, all right. So, so first of all, yeah, everything you said was correct. So, I just want to iterate, like, um, yeah, tell it in your words. Go ahead. So, 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 long story short, my relative, my big relative, big big psych from Swans, he's in the gang, gang intervention. You know okay. what I'm saying? Highly decorated Damu or whatever the case is. This is my real, this is my real shout out to him. Yeah. So I um. I tell him my interest, but since I've been out, he been trying to get me in for extras down there to PP, like, you know what I'm saying? Okay. The, you know, to chapter two or whatever the case is. Like, man, this y'all y'all the poster boys of this shit, man. Mm. Y'all come in been here, you know what I'm saying? This, this, and the third, we need y'all in here. So, you know, I'm like, 
since since this, like I told you, like the like thing, it pushed me forward because I didn't want to do ministry. You know what I'm saying? Whether it was outreach or whatever. You fuck me up when you say that word, bro. Yeah, you don't not you fucking the world up because we yeah. you, the way you hit the scene with the pot and you just yeah. you got this passion for ministry. It's like ah, right, go ahead, break bread. Yeah, so I have been you know my one of my biggest passions is, is is ministry. So it's different type of ministries. I always wanted to you know to help the youth, the outreach, whatever they, the, my, my community. You get what I'm saying? So not necessarily preaching or on a bullpen, not none of that. You know what I'm saying? But as far as mm -hmm. having a testimony. And, and feeling like I could reach the youth, or e even, 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 um, different men, or or even women. Right. So, long story short, so my relative he got me on the phone with PP. He like, man, come, you know, what I'm saying, ten o'clock or whatever the case is. I go up there. Long story short, I get up there. He like, well, all the slots is filled. You know, what I'm saying this really like we can get it. You, you put in the app, fill out the app, or whatever the case is. We we have something for you. We'll call you. But you know, this is a predominantly East side, you know what I'm saying? East side um situation. Yeah, 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 yeah. Situation. What I understand, I'm like, all right, but he like, listen, I think, you know what I'm saying, big such and such, he got the thing for the he got to our grid or whatever the case is. I'm like, oh, is that right? So I'm like, boom. I, I call down there, I don't get no answer. So I call somebody that's close with him. I'm like, hey, look, bro, they saying, you know what I'm saying, um, big bro, he got this or whatever the case is. Tap in with him. I'm on my way up there. You know what I'm saying? So he like, hold on before you get up there. I don't want you to get up there. I don't want you to get up there, man. You be pressing people. And so right. I'm like, because at this time, I'm like, listen, I'm out like, I don't know nobody but one homie, maybe two, that do this type of work. Right. So I'm like, but I know his resources. You know what I'm saying? I know his resources. They supposed to have an office or something. So I'm like, hold up. If he got that, bro, I'm, I'm on my way down there. So I'm on my way down there to Chris Ross Lawson. And, and my big homie, one of my G homies, he called me like, look, that ain't who got it. It's coming down a pipeline right now. Who got it? So I'm like, if he ain't got it, who got it? So when they it comes to my phone, it say like VOA. I look at it, I'm like, what the fuck is VOA? Like, what is, I never mind you, I never heard into anything like this. Right. So I'm like, VOA, like, so I look it up. It's Volunteers, Volunteers of America. When you look up the picture on the internet, it got, got Asian. You know what I'm saying? Asian people popping up. Not, not, not. I have anything that, against wrong with Asians. against Asians. But when I think, I'm like, the contract for my my hood is in the inner city. Which is Lamarck Park, Crenshaw District, South Man. Central LA, West Side. All black. Right. Be you know what I'm saying? Hispanic. You got a Hispanic community, but that's right. the only other community we got. Black and Hispanic, them the only communities. You get what I'm saying? Right, but yes. my, my section, like Lamarck Park, that's been dominated black. Of course. You get what I'm saying? Yes. So I'm like, how the, how this how these Asians like I'm like what I automatically just being bro like like what anger like man how the fuck like you, you know what called saying? me you was hot I could, I felt I wanted to get on the team and get out in the streets and do whatever we need to do right now but go ahead bro, keep building bro I was really beaming so I'm getting to my homies like like you dumbass niggas mm -hmm. like you know what I'm, I'm gonna just keep it a, keep it apart yeah. like me you dumbass niggas you niggas out here like you know what I'm saying such and such like like I'm like y'all ain't know the whole time like you know what I'm saying. So it, that got me mad. Like, bro, I just did 12 years. Like, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my homies and all that. But I just, I did the first thing. Free like all told, the real homies. The first thing that came to my mind is that when they say, um, if you don't want a black person to know nothing. Put it in the book. Put it in the book, bro. Ooh. And it fucked me up. Cause you, cause you know, I'm pro my people. And you know, it's like that, 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 that narrative or that, you know what I'm saying? Or that stereotype. I'm like, man, is it, like, come on, bro. Like we fit in the description. So, so I'm mad at them. So I get that settled. So I already tell them automatically, hey, I'm going after that contract, bro. Like these is people, not even a color. These people, you know what I'm saying, have our community getting yeah, all the they're resources. They're not a part of the community. Damn have, the color. They're not us. Of, but, I'm, I'm saying the color too. Correct. You know what I'm saying? It would it would it would hurt less. It would hurt less. You know what I'm saying? If if some if you know what I'm saying, if some brothers, you know right. what I'm saying, had it, but it hurt even worse. Correct. You know what I'm saying? That it's people don't even, not even our color. You know what I'm saying? And come and extracting all our resources Did out of our community. Were you able to locate anything that these people had established to benefit the community? No. So doing my research, I found two of my two of my older homies, two of my older homies that's actually employed by them. Mm. So they only have if if most people don't know my I have one of the biggest geographical na neighborhoods in like in LA County. So you know it's Chris Sort of Fed King the damn near 50, 50th. Mm -hmm. You know, so so you talking about all that is covered. So that's tens of millions of dollars, bro. And you only got two people that's from that community employed. Not only that, they employed, but they're on a minimum wage salary. 
In what capacity? Employed to do what? Is it just like fluff job? I don't want to blow nobody's spot up, but is it damn just man, just two people regardless? And then and then my G homie, and then my G homie, he said, bro, I've been trying to find out for four years, bro. Wow. You think I ain't been out here fighting? Cause I'm like, nigga, what the what? what? He like, little homie, young homie. This what I've been. You speaking to the choir? You know what I'm saying? I've been trying to find. I'm like, well, how? Like you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, like bro, we gotta get this together. I'm like, how much they pay you? He like, I only get, bro, I only get 40 a week, bro. You know what I'm saying? And they paying a nigga like a dub. I'm like, what? Like, nigga, dub, they, they making that at McDonald's. So you telling me, you telling me that it's only two people out of my whole neighborhood, bro, and they getting tens of millions of dollars? Wh wh where's where's the school drives at? Where, where's the Christmas programs? Where the back to school programs at? You get what I'm saying? Where, we need answers. Yeah, yeah. Respectfully. Where, 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 where is, where, mine's disrespectfully. And I, I second that. Yeah, where, where's the office at? Where's these? Where's this money going to? When people like myself get out of uh, get out of uh, get out of jail, and you know, we can go help these youth. Where the crossing guard people? Where these? Where's the people that that that's hired? You know what I'm saying to make sure the kids is getting to school back and forth safely. Where are the people employed at to make sure the old women ain't getting their pocketbooks st stolen or nothing like that? Or just for it to go around? These are the p people that who supposed to be employed. These are the people who the money is supposed to be issued to. You get what I'm saying? Right. If if you have a death in your family, like I just had, unfortunately, what if people ain't got the money to bury their face? It's hard out here, and it's right. expensive. You get what I'm saying? Right. Those be the type of programs that, like the PPs and the Big U, you can go to their programs and get this type of funding because they have it available. Right. And you know what I'm saying? They they doing right by their contract. They doing right. You know what I'm saying? By the by the community. Right. We have nothing to show for that. And now and only that they get intense. So basically, to me, it's it's a big Ponzi scheme. I agree. And, and not only that, if you if you see like I like like when I came out of came out um with it, a lot of people was in the comments like, oh VOA, they got this, they got this, they own they own um halfway houses out here, way in Maryland mm. and in New York and this. Oh, so this is a big corporation. If 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 a lot of people don't know what's going on in LA right now, what they do, what they trying to do, they trying to turn it into New York City. Anytime somebody sells something, anytime they try to sell something, or the moms and pop stores, they get or your your, your family. Your grandma sell her house, they knock it down and build, build apartments. That's what they do, they build it up. You know what I'm saying? Ever since the, um, they've been building the stadiums and all that That's over the there. downtown, you see it a lot yeah. too. Yeah, but in South Central, it don't look like South Central no it more. Don't. Bro, they got they got condominiums in yeah. in, 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 in townhomes. In Watts. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So, so, so what they do is, not only they extracting our, our resources and not giving us nothing, how they do the how they been doing this for for ages and even after they they extracting all the resources, but they what they doing with their corporations they gobbling up all the convenience stores. Now that's why you see around L.A. at Seven Elevens and Circle K's and all this they gobble up put it at the beauty salons and the beauty they gobble up all that. Nobody's hired in the other community and then they build these developed apartments and then they raise the rent and gentrify. You know what I'm saying? Our 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 neighborhood. I've often spoke to the disdain I feel when I realize when I walk out my house how difficult it is to spend a dollar with a black person right in my community. Can't find it. Yeah, I feel like. Can't find it. You look, when you really reflect on that, it feels like it's something being done to us. It is. It's not an accident that we stumbled up in the position where all these others are right here in our community. They That's drive right. in to get our money and leave every day. That's a fact. They want no other part of the community. That's, That's it. That's a fact. And, 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 and it's so sad to me. Like, it, it broke my heart, bro. Like, 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 what? Like, these, like, how dare you? Like, don't nobody, like, y'all not even in, in to be a corporation. Somebody of a, that community needs to have that, them resources. Why Why is it that if we have a PP, we have a big U, we got Skip Townsend, we got mm -hmm. your people from Swan. All of that, all of that Skip as well. Shout out to Skip too. Yeah. Why isn't it more automatic that the rest of these pockets that are available, why are we not turning each other on and making sure somebody's in position to have it? How do we allow this big void to be filled up by some agents? Shout out to the agents, but how do we allow that to happen when this is here for us? I have, I have, I have, I have no idea, but it it truly broke my heart when they when they said that. Like I, you it, feel it's correctable? Man, they gonna have to relinquish that. They gonna have to relinquish. They, they gonna have to relinquish that contract because, like I said, I'm putting everything behind it. I'm going public with it, and not only that, 
I just I just recently filed to, to get the proper paperwork to go get our contract. That's what I'm talking about my nigga. Yeah, that, 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 that's, you that, said that's D Jack is supporting you. Yeah, him Shout and out to Jack for that. Yeah, you know he's. But see, know. this is the thing. You got a nigga just did twelve years, mm -hmm. stump down nigga with all the bullshit. But a nigga that has matured, he's into ministry, but then he's also willing to put his energy into something bigger than himself, something yeah. that seems impossible to a lot of people. Something that's political in a lot of ways. I salute yeah. that because they want to knock us down and say all we is is the bullshit. Yeah. But it shows that energy that can be bottled up and directed to some bullshit can also be bottled up and directed to something positive. And exactly. I'm anxious to do whatever I can to support and see how far this go. Because that's some bullshit, bro. We couldn't go in their communities and do nothing like nothing, that. Nothing, bro. Nothing. You're not going to see, you're not even going to see one black owned business in Korea town, bro. They, 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 it's, it's, to, it's sold up to the point. We, everybody got a community, whether it's Miami, New York, LA, Chicago, everybody got it. They got a little Italy, a uh, uh, Tokyo, a yeah. uh, Korea town, and all. We're a little Africa. Our little Africa is projects. Yeah. That we kind of apartment builders. We talking about a whole district, you know what I'm saying, of just, People who community and they build it, they tore ours, ours down in, in, in Tulsa. You feel me? Black Wall right. Street. They got sections of Gardena where the whole for blocks, you don't see no English. Good. It's the Asian letters. Good. Yeah. They so don't you want can... your money. They don't care if you can understand. Exactly. Don't come in here. We don't Jewish, need Jewish, it. Jewish community. It's the same thing. The, the, the Hispanics doing that as well, too. The Mexican, they ain't even got, you know what I'm saying, level Mexico. You go to Linwood right there, that's that's Mexico Plaza, nigga. You right. You ain't got nowhere they saying, nigga, that's Africa. You right. Or you know what I'm saying? Or this this it's whatever you want to be called. Hebrew, you know what I'm saying, which I am, you know what I'm saying, Africa, who whatever. Muslim that you and you would show me show me a place where they got that, bro. Expound on that a little bit, your your religious convictions. Um, how long have you considered yourself a religious man and exactly what religion do you support or that you're a part of? Yeah, so I really I really don't consider myself relig re okay. religious. It's it's faith. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So um I've been in the truth like four years now. Okay. Which is, you know what I'm saying, Hebrew Israelite. I feel like it's not a religion. You know, we believe it's not a religion, it's who we are as people. I don't know if it's a stereotype, but you look like one of them niggas. <laughs> <laughs> My bad, but I can see you like you fit in with them. But go ahead. Salute to them. Yeah, so I like a lot of things I hear them say. Yeah, so so pretty much, you know, not a, you know, uh, to sum it up, you know, we we believe we the true we are the true children, children of Israel, you know. The person who y'all call Jesus, the Christians, we believe he black. You know what I'm saying? And it's the different names or whatever. And the Bible you know? was written about us. That's our book. Yeah, for sure. If you if you if you if you a person of faith, mm -hmm. the Bible. I don't care what Bible you read. It's gonna tell you. It's gonna point to you that all them people was black. They was of color. That's a fact. Mm -hmm. You know that 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 is a fact. So I, I know who I am. You know what I'm saying? I'm gracious. You know what I'm saying? And proud, you know, so and I, that's what I push. So is it to believe be believed that um somehow along the way us as our colored people did something that God was displeased with and that's why our plight upon the earth has been such treacherous. That's a fact, our our ancestors. ancestors. We broke we, we it's a, it's 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 in the Bible. We broke the covenant. And that's why in, in the Bible it's gonna say yo I'm a I'm a I'm a your people will suffer for three hundred years. Well, like the Bible the Bible is prophecy. Mm -hmm. If you if you if you read the Bible, it's gonna point to everything to people of color. You get what I'm saying? He said I'm a three hundred years. You are gonna suffer. I'm gonna send you to a foreign land with the yoke of iron around your chains on a ship. Mm -hmm. Name other what what other nationality that had the yoke of iron? You know what the yoke of iron is, right? Remember on the slave ships? Yeah, they had some big ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So. I, I just, it's to me, I done read the Quran, you know, shout out to my mother brothers as well. You know, we had a, a lot of same beliefs as well, you know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, it points you to first, us. When you first used the phrase most high, that's what I thought. That's why yeah, I said I religion at first. Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's what it do. I, sal I salute that because just because, I just it for the my life. you, Why yeah. It changed my life, bro, my whole, Balance. I, honestly, to be honest, if I never came in the truth, if I never, if I never came into the truth, bro, I would have never had the perspective I would have never had the perspective that I have today, bro. Mm. And the perspective I had today is so much more, and so I feel like it's everything, bro. Like you know what I'm saying? Like it gave it gave me a different perspective on. You come across everything. somewhat militant. Is that due to the spiritualism, or have you always been like that with your structure from gelling and shit coming up? Well, I would say I would always I would always have some uh, some militant instincts because like I said, all my all my uncles, even Foex's father, was a Black Panther. Okay. You get what I'm saying? Say but that. but at the same but at the same time, like as far as like 
I wouldn't say like once I start game banging, I was militant. Nah, I was young, dumb, wild. But when I went to the pen, I learned more structure. You get what I'm saying? So I, I learned the structure as to how to, how to how to move and maneuver. You know what I'm saying and stuff like that. But as far as my minute, it, it do comes from my, my faith. It do, it do because I know I know the bigger picture and I know what's going on. We under the attack out here. You get what I'm saying? They they pin us against each other, bro. It's like once I came into the truth and I, I really learned who I was and I see it. It just, bro, it's just like, nah, bro, y'all not about to trick me, bro. Like, I don't care if a motherfucker from Hoover, I don't care if you from a Trey. Cause I, I start looking at it different. Like, nigga, these my brothers, bro. You not, I see the things, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? And then we get together and it's always the government or somebody else turning us against each other. You get what I'm saying? I, I just, I just never wanted, once I, I was like, hell no, nah, fuck that. Because at the end of the day, even when the nigga was on the yard, bro. Like when I when I went to the hole, like you know, you gotta get your property first. When I, when I went to the hole in the riot, and it was it was you know what I'm saying, brothers already back there. You know who's who the first one? Hey turtle, it's forty. Hey, hey nigga, you hungry? Like and this nigga, be, nigga, man, bro, just humans, come on, yes. bro. This this a nigga from who? This is my worst enemy, a nigga from trouble. Like you know what I'm saying? Like you know, oh, I'm on that subject, I saw yeah. the little nigga Treyway from Hoover. Yeah. Um, super turned up last few years. Yeah. This and all that, this and his name and all that. Mm -hmm. But I saw a clip of him the other day online and he was speaking to her. Somebody asked him would he be willing to work with uh, x -Fo. Yeah. And his response was surprisingly mature. Yeah. And it kind of spoke to what you're speaking of right now. Yeah. That system. He's been in that system for a few years. Yeah. And it just, it does that to you. I know when I was really gelling back in the day, mm -hmm. the racial shit was really up. So I learned that crip blood op shit didn't matter fast. We was all right, bro. yeah. We we all won, but I I, I know to, to to speak to speak on 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 Treyway because he's young. He got that little fame. You know what I'm saying? And that that's what it takes. You know what I'm saying? These kids, these they, they kids, man. These, these kids. I didn't, I didn't complete my thought. What I didn't. I he they, he said he'd be willing to yeah. work with your homie. Yeah. But Munchy B shot Munchy B. Mm -hmm. He tend to think that X Four. Is not gonna be willing. You think X4 has gotten to that maturity level yet? No. <laughs> nah, hell no. Nah, bro. Ain't. Much, you might be right, Bunchy. Nah, nah. He but, not, shout he out, hey, but still, shout out to you, Treyway, just for but, being man enough to. But I don't, I don't, yeah. For thinking outside the box, I mean, it is about that, but you can't, you gotta let everybody go at their own pace, too, because we know what we signed up for. Yeah, shout out, yeah, sh shout, shout out, shout out to you, too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, but at the same time, I feel like. I, I, he probably if the bag right, like you know what I'm saying. I, I don't see what he'll be. He'll be. A, he'll be a goddamn fool not to. You know what I'm right, saying. But right. you do have people who study they set in their ways. And me knowing him, you know what I'm saying. For the time that I've been knowing, he's stubborn, bro. Oh, he's stubborn. He'll pass. He'll he pass a bag up. He out, stubborn. right? Yeah, he out. Yeah, he currently out. He, he got some. He, he we finna. He, he gonna make some moves. I mean, he should. He's, be, he's yeah. signed six figure, nigga. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. He see shit. I know it's some little. Uh, mess controversy with his little business situation and his representation and all that. I didn't know if yeah. it panned out smooth. To be honest, I don't even discuss it. I don't even discuss it. It's like his, his affair and stuff it. like I that. I can respect it. I can respect it. I can respect yeah. it, man. Um, uh, what about, uh, I, I'm only going to ask you about certain individuals because it's all love and they've been here before. Yeah. Um, Baby Runner been here promoting this book. Yeah. Um, Y'all got a relationship? Yeah, I've been knowing him since, since he been from the hood. How does it feel to have a pocket of homies with a presence and it seemed like it's an energy around? It's like, you know, the, the touchdown seem a little closer than it felt when you got yeah. some comrades that's, you know, you can, it's yeah. not just you, it's him, him, him. Then you got yeah. D-Jack and it's like, do it feel like y'all got the energy? I definitely do. I definitely think, you know, the, um, the Fodies got the ball right now. I, I, I definitely do. It's a lot of it's a lot of uh, light that's that's in our area right now, whether it's good or bad. You know, it's it's I, I, f I feel good. I, I can't especially to him because he been doing it longer than everybody. Mm -hmm. And he talented, bro. Like that's one thing I can say about the homie. Like he talented. He a standout. Like it's it's a lot of the people that can rap. It's a lot of people can do certain things. But to me, he like one of the people that he stand out. And I and always gave him his props, like, you, bro, you hard, cuz. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you hard. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't tell him too often these days, you know what I'm saying? Because he be letting that bullshit go to his head. You Stay know, off Clubhouse, be, runner. Man, you know what I'm saying? So, Stay so, off Clubhouse, yeah, cuz. I, I, I definitely, I tell, I definitely tell, him, tell my bro, like, man, you hard. Like, nigga, he, he hard. He, 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 got, he, got, he got it. He got the juice. He's, he's very articulate. Yeah. But that Clubhouse, 
it's, it's stay, it gets an environment where he forget that the world is listening. And yeah. I be hearing him on there going dumb on niggas, like mm. going stupid. I'm like, no, nah, don't do it. Uh, yeah. He be talking about pulling up and all that. Don't do it. Yeah. Uh, don't do it. It ain't worth it. Yeah. Not on Clubhouse, man. Yeah, but you you got to realize this though, Spider. You 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 can attest to this as well. I know you didn't lost your cool, and it's just most recently me, like, but because you feel like uh we forget. Like a lot of people who see us in a, like an alarm light or whatever the case is, case is, like they forget who you were before you mm. was in the limelight. You get what I'm saying? So, like I know me, like I'm I'm born and I'm I'm trained to go. Like you know, I'm trained a certain way. You gotta understand, like where I just came from, everything is a sign of disrespect. No, that's why I felt like I would take it upon myself to be the one to tell the homie mm -hmm. in general, just in fun but seriousness. Yeah. Cause you can't take it from everybody, but I have been there. I know how it goes. So I would imagine if I said motherfucker might be like, okay, and give it a second thought. Yeah. But cause what I've learned is this, if we respond and react based upon our way we was trained and built, we give them the control. Yeah. Just look where we at. And everybody got something to say. So if we if our if our protocol is everybody got something to say, I'm gonna make it my business to get to you, get to you, get to you, mm -hmm. you're gonna be chasing them all day. And all yeah. somebody got to do is say something. Yeah, I, you know what I'm saying? That's what I've learned. And I know the homie be turned. He be super turned. Yeah, he do. I know he not performing. Some might think it's a, I, he's not playing, so I just. No, he really like that. Yeah, yeah, on my mama, mama. And uh, he letting his baby mama drag him on there. I just be like, be careful, y'all. They got y'all together can do some good things, creating content. Yeah, they, 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 they put they your both minds know. together. Y'all can do some dope shit. Y'all both yeah. got a buzz of following. Y'all politic together. Y'all got a good rapport. I'm saluting to that. On yeah. my mama, mama. Yeah, I had um before I lose my train of thought. I had wanted to say something as well though. Uh, because like 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 I said, man. You know, I've been on this campaign. You know, I, I promote peace. You know, that's what I am. Peace, unity building up our, our communities, you know what I'm saying? Taking back our communities, you know what I'm saying? And uplifting our communities. But it was a analogy I wanted to use. And I told you this, this, it is crazy because this, this not even, this not, a, this not, this wasn't planned or nothing. When he got here, he said, I'm glad you got that right there. The you already know where I'm going. Speaking the chessboard, I'm, I'm following you. Okay? Yeah, so, 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 so the chessboard, so I'm a chess player myself. Likewise. You know what I'm saying? So, all right. So all the chess players out there, they know exactly what I'm saying. So I look at the chessboard and I see black and I see white. Mm. So if you see black right here, if you see black right here, you see white. Black people, we tend, and I feel like this is a, this is our this is our biggest problem. And once we we learn this and realize this, we'll be all right as a people as a whole. So this is the white people. Mm. They always, if you notice the white people, they always work with a full board. What I mean by a full board, they come in with all their pieces. Mm. Wealth, education, health. You get what I'm saying? They they come from a long line of just either either money, intelligence, or whatever the case is. You know, mm -hmm. whatever, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. The black people. This the this the black side right here. We're never work with a full board. We take our rooks off. We took our knights off. We take our bishops off. Mm. We even, on the case, we sacrifice the queen. We get a queen up. Mm. But any good chess player knows you could play without your queen. All right. If you want to style, you're, you're good. You're, you know what I'm saying? But at some point in time, if you lose too many pieces, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. Any good chess player is going to beat you every day of the week. Mm. And what I mean is, and what I, what I mean by that is the black people, we take off our roots, our knights, and our bishops, and our queens, meaning we game bang. It's the generational curse. We keep it going. If you grew up in the hood, we let our kids, we gang bang. You get what I'm saying? No education. We dropping out of school. We robbing. We stealing. We killing. We going to jail. You know what I'm saying? All that's a generational curse. So you taking every time that you doing something, you fucking up our credit. You know what I'm saying? By the time you're putting bills in the kid's name or whatever. And it's not, it, 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 all the people out here, this not all black people. Some people, black people got together. I'm just speaking as, speaking as, 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 the as, problem. I hear you. Exactly. Yes, so yes. if you looking, we teaching our kids, oh, don't snitch on this, don't do this, don't do this, don't go be the police, don't do this. I'm not, listen, I'm not condoning snitching or nothing like that. I'm not saying nothing like that. I'm just saying what's in when we raise, this what you're taught. We don't snitch, keep your mouth shut, you know what I'm saying? So on and so forth. 
So when you taking all them pieces off the board, like how could you ever win a game of chess? How could how how how, how could we ever win a game of chess? You can't win. can't win. People need to see, and this and this that's why I told the last person who interviewed me. I told them I was lied to. I told them, you know what I'm saying? It was it, when I, I thought I thought this was the coolest thing in the world until I start living it out and I start reaping the, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I start suffering the consequences of my actions. Being in jail, not going to store, homies fucking a nigga bitch. You get what I'm saying? Can't ask a nigga for $40, I'm for 40s, nigga, I can't even get $40 from you niggas. No letters, no nothing. Yeah, we are our own men, but at the same time, this is what portrayed, This, mm -hmm. this at least when I was growing up. Right, no, the I homies get. got you, this, this, that, and the third. They got your best interest at heart. Niggas gonna hold you down. Niggas gonna do this, 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 that, and the third. And that's just not the case no more. It's oh. not the case. So I'm not about to sit here, allow, I'm not gonna tell my son this. I don't want my son to game bang. I'm not gonna tell I'm, my son, nigga. You not ah, so I break your jaw, nigga. You not about to do this. So why would I keep? Why would I tell? I'm not. My I don't. Sons know. That's exactly yeah. What I told. Yeah, but see, yeah, but see, that's what I'm saying. I don't feel comfortable with being a hypocrite, bro. And for a lot of years, people don't want to admit it. I was being a hypocrite mm. because I'm telling my son, hey, you doing? You doing good in school? You doing your homework? You listening to your mom? But at the same time, nigga, I wasn't even. You know what I'm saying? I'm game banging full fledged in it. You know what I'm saying? I wish a nigga would this the hood. I'm not about to tell my son this, so why would I tell somebody else son this, bro? I just feel like that's not cool, bro. It, that's that's just that's just where I'm at in my life. I feel like it's, it's so many people who feel the way I, I want to feel, but they not their own man. They scared of the backlash. All oh, he ain't the business. He ain't with business. All oh, he ain't with the man. I don't give a fuck about that shit, bro. I'm not with exactly. the sad trip. I'm not. I'm not about to teach nobody kids this. You get what I'm saying? Right, I feel like definitely. I honest. I honestly feel like, bro. If if you change a life, you save a life, bro. Mm -hmm. And that's how I look at it. Everybody not gonna get my message. Exactly. You get what I'm saying? But it's gonna be a couple kids out there like, man, I don't want this. I'm telling them like, nigga, nigga, your homie's gonna be fucking you. That little, that little girl that you like, the homie's gonna be fucking her. Believe it. Believe it. And have a baby, leave you all. This, this will come with the street life. You get what I'm saying? Like so on and so forth. Nigga, nigga up in this motherfucker stressed out, in you in a box 24 seven, you can't get no licks back, no nothing. And. The same nigga you was out trying to whack or put it Come down on, on his on. his homie gonna be your neighbor and it's not, on, bro. no problem. No problem. It's gonna be cool. Like he say, when you get to the hole, on, bro. he gonna shoot you some soups first. Come on, bro. On my mama mama. We killing each other. Just How like old that. is your boy? Bro, he 12. Is your only child? Nah. How, how many children you got? I got three. You got three. Salute to That's all the babies. Right now, he the oldest three. mid? Nah, he he the second, he second youngest. Is he youngest. the only boy? Yeah, he the only boy right now. Yeah. He got the fever for the bullshit? Nah, hell no, and he's so smart, bro. That's he's right. so smart. That's he a right. gamer. My little nigga a gamer. That's he is right. in sports. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm fortunate, you know what I'm saying? His his mom in that aspect, man, his mom did her thing with that. Like I said, so I was going, I was going, I was going for majority. It's like I used to parent from over the phone, but you know, she was actually there. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's Despite right. our differences, she she did her thing with my man. My son, he hella smart, hella talented, ain't That's interested right. interested in that. But I'm lucky though, bro, because he know who his dad is. I can relate. You know what I'm saying? He he you know what I'm saying? He he know who's his dad is and he like, nah, that ain't me. That ain't you know what I'm bro. saying? I'm just I'm fortunate please, though, please bro. Please speak to how relieving, refreshing oh, when you know you don't deserve it. Yeah. And I God still you I didn't either. Yeah. I, I, I know. Just talk yeah. about how like that I see you blushing. It makes yeah. me like that's, every, can I, can I, can I, can I, that's my that's my boy, man. Billy Beans, man. I love you, son. Yeah, that that's um right. Yeah, I, um, Three I, C's, I love you too, fellas. I appreciate y'all holding me down by yeah. not getting involved in none of that knucklehead bullshit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I, um, bro, it's just like, like I said, it's a blessing. It's a lot of blessings. It's a lot of blessings that I get that I know I'm not deserving of, mm -hmm. but that just let me know, like, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's, I got a purpose. You get what I'm saying? It's like, I got a purpose because there's so many people here that, that can't say that about their kids. Right. You know, my dad yes. can't say that about his son because I'm, Mine as well, and yeah, my yeah, father yeah. didn't set the example that I yeah. set for my sons, exactly. and I still fucked over it in that sense what he tried to do. Yeah, and my kids still bless me. It's like crazy. That's yeah. Oh, yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, so so that's why that's why I feel like you know when you got blessings, you got you got to truly count them, you know, and try to pass it off on, on somebody else because my influence. I know I'm an influ a very influential pe a person. You are. Y you know what I'm saying? So I know about how long have you known that? A while now, but but you know when the generations has passed, and it's, you got young homies that's 
10 and 15 years younger. You wonder, I, do, is it going to still translate? I see myself in them. That's why I really know, like, oh, big homie, what the what the what the what the, what the, what the big bro, and what the... And I remember I, I was that I was that same person. Like anything, right. like the big homies used to tell me, you know what I'm saying? You know how I was. Right. Like, hold yes, the strap. Yes, you young, you don't hold yes. the strap. The, the big homie got me holding the strap. I'm holding you. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, you know what I'm saying? Nigga not knowing, like, yeah, the only reason why you got the strap. Yeah, nigga, yeah, you 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 yeah, you a kid. They yeah, just gonna take you to the yeah. station, and you gonna your parents gonna pick you up. You gonna get whoa out. You yeah. get that ass whooping. But that don't be point straight. you making the kid yeah. word is deep because no matter how grown we tried to make this shit, this shit was started by some kids. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Yeah, I agree. But I still believe that there is um, an opportunity for us to do some cleansing because mm -hmm. it's so here. It's not gonna disappear. So us yeah. as members, participants former to some degree the best we can do is do better as members it's not like there's no such thing as because even me being public figure all these years yeah niggas know i'm not out here turned up on purpose trying to be nothing yeah but there's nowhere i could go where people don't look at me like an ec exactly so it's not like i'm i'm not from around like no stop calling me that but guess what I'm ec i'm whatever but this is how I live my life so this exactly. is niggas that live like this that's also stumped out. I done been through the bullshit, you feel me? I'm not trying to, like you say, perpetrate no bullshit for nobody else's kids. I look, of course, you know, you can't predict the future. My yeah. boys are 15, 16, and 17. And for what is projected, they not going that way. Yeah, yeah. So what I look like doing anything that'll fuck off your son's perception of how life should be. I felt you the most when you said that, bro. Oh, yeah, because, because you gotta understand I mean, women, women, women matter, women matter, but bro, I'ma just keep it real, just how I feel like, you know what I'm saying, the man, the man is the most important piece on that chessboard. Your king, your, your queen can die. That's why I saw, I, 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 I analyze everything to it. I, I live my life through that because a queen could die and you still can win a game of chess. The king can't, the, you can't sacrifice, the king dies, it's, it's Everything over with. on that board is to go sacrifice before the king. The king, the last thing to have to do anything to exactly. even help the situation. Exactly. I feel you. Everything is to protect the king. That's yeah. the seed. That's the yeah. whole shit. Exactly. Hey, but look, listen. One more thing I want to say about this chessboard and my analogy on that. So if you take, if you if you a chess player, if you take the rook, the castle, um, um, the bishop, all, all that. You take all that, but the king off the board. What do you have left? The pawns. Pawns. That's all you have. And what 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 pawns what pawns do? They just push forward. Mm -hmm. You have no you have no you have no, no defense. Strategic angles, nothing. You can't yeah. do nothing. No maneuvers. You know what I'm saying? All you can do is push forward and basically kamikaze mm -hmm. yourself. That's what that's that's what black people out here doing. We take all our important pieces, we give it away. Like I said, credit. I ain't gonna get back into the but every. You know what I'm saying? No, like, feel free to build, bro. Yeah, yeah. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I said, the credit. You know what I'm saying? The game banging, the the, the education, to just everything. You just. Uh, what about what do you what do you how, what do you factor in the lack of awareness and respect for the family unit and our mm -hmm. culture? You don't see many people trying to court one girl and make it right with her and do the right thing and plan to get married and mm -hmm. have kids. It's like that's a lost idea. Yeah, I I think I think it has some has some, like again I think it has a portion to do with the type of environment. The type of environment that's you know people being products of the environment and what they seeing a lot of that but then i just think it's a different time bro like as far as like cause like i said i'm i'm i'm, I'm faith-based like i'll be in that bible so i feel a lot of a lot of women and it's not no shot of no women no 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 type of women or nothing because there's a lot of good women out there who's Damn. doing what they supposed to do but i feel like this independent time they going against you know what i'm saying tradition that's why I feel like it, to, to sum it up, it's the tr tradition is being lost. lost. Not not saying that women has to stay in the nineteen hundreds right. or whatever the case is. More women feel like, nigga, I'm I get my own money, I got my own back, or this this, or, and they more in tune with their sexuality. You know, so they don't care if like nigga, so I fucked him, so what? Yeah, I fucked him, I fucked him. Now that that's gone, it's like. It's a whole different dynamic, bro. Yeah, then you get talked bad about, oh, you slut shaming and all that. Yeah, that bitch, you a slut. You know what I'm saying? So, so you um, know what I mean? Imagine yeah. slut shaming is a thing yeah. to make you feel guilty for recognizing yeah. someone is a slur. That's deep, bro. Yeah. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah, so 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 my whole thing about it is because even you even got some ratchets, though, that's very good mothers, bro. That's mm. very good mothers. I'm going to keep it a buck because I know a lot of them. That's very, that, you know what I'm saying? That's very good mothers. But my whole thing about that is, is they take the 
So I'm going to just say this. I feel like a lot of women in our community, as far as like, I'm going to say the inner city, which meaning the, nigga, the slum, the ghetto, like you get what I'm saying, feels they can be that father and that mother. And they can't, it's give or take. Yeah, you can raise, you can raise your son. You can raise your daughter, but you can't, you can't teach a man how to be a man. That's just like me. I got daughters. I can't teach. When my daughter first got her period, I'm like, what the fuck? I don't want to even talk. Like, I can't Whoa. teach you how to wipe yourself or clean yourself. That's crazy. Cause look, I got three daughters. Yeah. Um, at this point, they all have reached that point in life. They're, yeah. They're 20, 24 and 12. Yeah. But when there was only one, when the first one got to that point, it, this is my experience with that. I remember laying in my bed, sleep, and she came and walked us. My oldest daughter, she came and walked. She's like, Daddy. I'm like, I turned off, like, what's up? She said, um, um, she said about a million ums to the mm -hmm. I'm like, man, um, what, what, what? Yeah. She's like, I got my period. I'm like, so I got a system to where my sister stayed in my units. Yeah. So I called my sister, I'm like, hey, woo -woo -woo -woo. my sister came. They went in the room, just a little talking. Called my mama, told my mama. My mama pulled up, got yeah. in the car. They hit some corners, whoop whoop. Came back for years. I've never heard of a period again. Never yeah. seen it. Yeah. Then some years later, my uh, second daughter, the day her shit hit, her and my oldest daughter in the back room somewhere. And my oldest daughter like, Daddy, I'm like what? You remember? Yeah. Yeah. Who is Genesis too? I'm like, damn, so I was the first person to get the announcement for both my oldest daughters, but then when my youngest daughter had her situation, she called and told me so, yeah. But I don't know what to tell them either, but I had a system in place. Yeah, but that that goes to show you that's that, that's not our nature though. Mm -hmm. that, that's for that's for a woman to teach a, 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 her her daughter, a young a young lady, mm -hmm. how to become a woman, how to be a woman. I can't taste, I don't have a have vagina. A right. We don't have a vagina. How can we teach them how to clean themselves properly, wipe right. themselves and all that? The same thing, you know what I'm saying, with a boy. Right. A woman can't teach, and that's I feel like we got away with as far as when you were speaking to the family aspect of it. Mm -hmm. A lot of these dudes be wanting to be a family, bro. Mm -hmm. I know I wanted to, that's all I ever wanted is a family. I grew up in foster care, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. yeah, you saw, I, I, I was raised by my granny. Fortunate enough, I was, I was raised by my granny. She came and got me and my brothers and sisters, but I know what it's like. You know what I'm saying? Not to have a mom, you know what I'm saying, or, or father around, you know what I'm saying, for years. You know so, what I'm saying? Are you just co parenting or are you in a relationship with your kid's mother? I'm co parenting right now. So, but in the future, you seek and establish yourself in the family situation and structure and all that. I mean, what? what I can't what, see what, you doing it no other way. The way you carry yourself, yeah, bro, like what, the what discipline other? and the firmness that yeah. you use and most of the yeah. things, I, I, I see that. I, I can see yeah. you set up. Right, and that's the way I think the, we need yeah. to be in our community. I, I've, I've heard this said, and I never realized that I heard it said, a mighty nation is not a mighty nation because it's mighty. Mm -hmm. A mighty nation is mighty because it's built of a lot of mighty, small, well-knit families, and that's what creates a mighty nation. And, and, and I agree, but to be to be honest with you, it's like even, even with my push, bro, the way I'll be pushing, it be like I'll be getting more hate like trying to, trying to, trying to just do right. You know what I'm saying? Then when I was out, I was out here thugging like, you know what I'm right. saying? Like even like to my family, like even, you know what I'm saying? It's like, even like with the holidays, you know, I don't celebrate holidays or mm. stuff like that. How so does that like, work? I just, I just, I, I know you, you know, everybody unless, happy, you get dressed. How do yeah. you avoid it when you right here in the middle? You just don't spend money on it and you still just go to the functions and nah, whatever. So, so I, 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 I would like, I kind of celebrated my birthday. You know what I'm saying? Mm. When I got out. You know what I'm saying? It was my it was my first anything out, so I kind of like indulge in that. But if, okay. as far as anything else, like I just don't be, and that be a conflict. Like Christmas, if it ain't a holy day in the Bible, I don't celebrate it. You get what I'm saying? So Christmas and birthdays, you know, but my kids they accustomed to it now. My but like like with the mother of my children, it was a problem. You know what I'm saying? It, 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 yeah, it was a problem. Like, oh, nigga, you weird. You would do what you say. You know what I'm saying? Like, no, shout out to moms because whether you understand yeah. him now, I feel you in, initially. I feel yeah, it. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, nigga, you weird. You been doing this? What the what the what the what? It's like, man, I'm not that time. I'm not that person no more. So it it, it was crazy because it's like I can accept. If I can accept the change, it's harder for other people to accept my change mm. than I, did, it you was know what I'm saying? It's difficult for you to change, but y'all can't even accept it. They ain't got to do nothing but accept it. And I'm trying to do right. Mm, that's deep. 
That's so that, that that's what I be dealing with now. Like, oh, what do what people be feeling a certain type of way? I'm like, bro, like, yo, shut me out. This my, my I'll be like, bro, I don't even sell it. You know what I'm saying? Like, no, respectfully, you know what I mean? But honey, I'm gonna do it anyway, though. That's that's just not me. So that be what I be going through right now. But I have to what I be telling my I'll be telling the mother of my kids. I even told my, my my kids, it's like, listen, I don't need no holiday to tell me to celebrate you. Mm. Your birthday is every day. Like, I'm not the richest man. I'm not, you know what I'm saying? Like, but at the same time, you already know, even when I was in prison, every time you asked me for something, didn't I come through? So on that day, when your baby is feeling like everything's about me, hey, 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 mm -hmm. and they daddy got to tap out, you, you you won't even pull up to the party, give him a hug, put a few dollars in his pocket, nothing. But you explained it to me. They know. I get they, you. They, they, yeah, they, 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 they know what time it is. Like, I, I bet you know they're saying? gonna learn to appreciate that probably for yeah. some reason more in the uh, long run. I'm standing, then I'm, standing, I'm just, I just stand on business, but they know like my son, my daughter, like, daddy. I need woo, woo. I need to cash out with some food, or I need some V bucks. I need some rope. Uh, Every right. time you know if I got it, see that's Roblox. You finna say Roblox? Yeah, Roblox. Roblox. <laughs> they be, yeah, they be tearing me up. What? You be, be tearing me up on that like, all right, right, video game. Or, knock it off with them Roblox girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. I just, you know, like I said, if I got it, you can have a shirt off my back. They know, like, if daddy got it, I got hung. Yeah, I don't I don't need no no, no holiday to, you know what I'm saying, to tell me to celebrate you. My two, my three boys that are 15, 16, and 17, they, ironically, I don't know where this comes from. They're the type of kids you can take them to the mall, the biggest mm -hmm. shoe store. Like, go ahead, get something. And they'll literally look through everything and be like, I don't see nothing I like. Yeah. And you know we gonna find something no matter what they that's really my, gonna look that's how my son and is if they don't really see nothing that's really yeah. fitting them they not yeah. gonna just grab something just because it's something yeah. that's how that, that's, that's how my the girls son haven't is. quite figured that out but my boys i don't know i, I mean i appreciate like, these yeah. niggas so much for that type of shit, bro my daughter she want everything yeah daughter, they, want <laughs> they gonna everything. want it bro this, yeah they want it i want this yeah when they ain't wearing no adidas i'm not wearing no. i want dunks jordans and then yes. the shoe. i don't need jewelry all i'm like oh my yes. god my bro you know what i mean but yeah my son he that he a cool cat. That's why I love my little nigga so much. Man, he a That's cool right. cat. Quiet, don't mess with nobody. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. What's his sport? Oh, uh, football. Football. That's right. Yeah, That's football. Right. But he he tall as a must. He was waiting for you know saying the basketball season or whatever too. I'm now I'm out, so I could be like his, his mom work a lot. You know what I'm saying? So she wasn't able. You know what I'm he saying? It's weight. Now I could. You know. That's right. Yeah, I'm, right. I'm I'm waiting to be on all the games. You know what I'm saying with my little signs and nigga, that's my little. You know what I'm it's saying? A, it's like a beautiful yeah, feeling, bro. Yeah, man, you gonna love yeah, it, man. Yeah, yeah, my daughter's just started cheer right now, so uh, I'm gonna be up there too. Yeah, you she know? go to a black school? Nah, they okay. in the down, they in the downtown area, so you know that, that. Yeah, so you know that's kind of like little Mexico. You okay. feel me? Okay, so she might be cool, yeah, because yeah. the Mexican yeah. shit is they should be cool. But yeah. Some of them black. No, no, girls, she, you, like, you, you know, she um uh, she drilling or like um uh, she gonna cheer for like. Private, like oh, yeah, that's they do the cool. Yeah, the give little, me a K. Yeah, yeah, yeah that type of Yeah, that's cool. I fuck with that. Yeah, she won't even cheer for in one of them schools. Like my daughter, she want to be around her people. She, she ain't fucking with it. That's right. That's right. How old is she? Oh, she thirteen. She thirteen. 14. You said you got three. Yeah, twelve, thirteen, and um, one just turned twelve right now. So two twelves. No, yeah, two twelve. My son would be thirteen in August. So my my youngest, they eight months apart. So somebody told me that my my boys was ghetto twins. I didn't know that phrase until they, cause they they fifteen, sixteen, and seventeen. Mm -hmm. But in July they'll be sixteen, yeah. sixteen, and seventeen. Yeah, my youngest is 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 all uh, they eight months apart. They they buy different mothers though. I heard you mention books and that it offended you that the reality is true that if you want to hide it from us, you put it in a book. Mm -hmm. Is there? It was my experience with Neighborhood Nip that I realized every time I asked him for advice, he would always refer me to a book. Mm -hmm. I actually bought, purchased one of the books he referred me to, but do you have a favorite book that you've read that have meant the most to you? Outside of your spiritual books. Oh, I, was about to, I was about to say, yeah, I don't want to- No, fuck uh, that. I don't want to even give you no limitations. Nah, my bad. Nah, but I, 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 would, I, would, I, would, I would say globally, I said The Art of War, man. The Art of War, hmm, that's Tupac's, one of Tupac's favorite books. I got cause it, it teach like I said that game of chess, bro. If you mm. apply your life to it, bro, that's that's not it, bro. It teach you a lot, but not only it teach you a lot to how to move and maneuver. It 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 shows you like nigga like oh I heal folks oh I can't. It, it also show you like the offense and the defense side. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So I, I would say like out of all times, like I gotta you know what I'm saying besides my little black Arthur's, you know what I'm saying? But um, but yeah, I got definitely, I definitely got um. Yeah, I definitely, yeah. Yeah, I, I definitely, I definitely fuck with it. You found it? I don't know if it's on this 
Oh, he got he he's got an go avid reader. Yeah. Oh yeah, this, yeah. This, 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 that's all I that's all I did. Yeah. But you know, but, but just for as far as his books, period. Like I always and look, Jill taught me that because I was so much of a uh, close close minded person when I came. All I read was Black Arthur's, mm. Nicky Turner. You know what I'm but saying? But that's the that's same the typical thing. That's what niggas is feeding you. Yeah, yeah. Anything else, I, but I don't want to be. But 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 being in that shoe, being in that hole. Nigga, you know what I'm saying? When it's up, like only thing up in that motherfucking nigga, nigga, nigga is, is is your hygiene. Mm. You know, in the shoe program, certain shoe programs, they come get that mac. You know what I'm saying? You on a concrete slab. That's how they was doing us, especially yeah. with, with this, when we had war with the, with the war with the police. Oh yeah, because because you know you use the mats to come out. You oh, made, they sell it straight. So let me let's get that. You know what I'm saying? So we we, <laughs> we yeah on everything. So we up in there, we up in there making um you know what I'm saying cars, playing cars out of milk cartons. Hey man, say yo say yo say yo milk cartons. All the homies, if we already got us, hey y'all say y'all milk cartons. You know what I'm saying? What about the uh, the the dice out the toilet paper? Oh, you already that, know, or, or the fireball? <laughs> fireball. Yeah, but <laughs> yeah, the fireball. Crazy. Yeah, we you yeah, will up in there. We was yeah, up real resource for what? Yeah, but then, but you know that cart that come by, they ain't gonna have a lot of black authors. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And then if your people send them in, you only could get ten books. So you know them them the pay. Page turners like Zane and Dutch and, and all the Sex Chronicles and all that. Right. Nigga, them page turners, so nigga, you know what I'm saying? I'm burning through those. Right. You got to put it down because they, they so interesting. And so so I, I learned to pick up some different stuff like that you didn't expect to like. And liked it. And, liked you know what I'm saying? And, and really liked it, bro. So I just now, I'm off Westerns. I'm off Romance. I'm off Sci Fi. You, you know what I'm saying? How like, about writing? You ever thought about writing a book? Yeah, of course. I, but but you, know, it's, you know, it's crazy because I had like. I still, I still, I, I still got um, I got a couple of books that's almost finished, mm. but I had to restart it over because, like I said, I end up um, I actually paroled from prison in 2017, mm. but I, I caught an in-house case. I, oh, you said that. Yeah, yeah. So we was they were sending this one. They were sending California inmates out out of state. We had came back from Oklahoma. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I was I was I was in Tallahatchie, Mississippi. I was in Siri, Oklahoma, which is North Fork. My nephew and I, was out in Mississippi. Yeah, and I was in um I was in Red Rock in um La Palma. They shot you around. Yeah, I was yeah, we, we was, out. was you able to have a video game in your cell? Yeah. Xbox three six uh, or I, I, PlayStation. I, I, yeah. did, I was in prison in the nineties. Yeah. I remember standing in my motherfucking window, looking at the empty day room middle of the night and, yeah. and wishing if I could just have a video game, yeah. that shit sound like fake jelly. When I heard niggas yeah. can have an Xbox and they sell, yeah, when we was out of state, yeah, that's not jelly to me, bro. Yeah, it's not. It, it, you it, go it, by, yeah, it, I'm it, stuck. Yeah, it was. It was. We was. We was. We was definitely having a lot of fun out there. But um, unfortunately, when I was out there and I was still doing my my California time, I ended up catching attempted murder on an inmate out there. Mm. And nigga, when I'm telling you, when I nigga broke my heart, broke my heart, bro. I ended up getting eight. I gave eight years for that attempted murder wait, wait, on wait, an wait, inmate. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. How short were you to the house? Well, this was December 15. I was about like a year and a half out. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm glad you out so we can slightly laugh. Yeah. Like, Wait a minute. So you a year and how, a year so, so the thought process, fuck the time you did up until that point. And I'm going to go, go ahead. I'm going to let you land. I'm going to tell you something else, which is crazy as well. But go ahead. Just, just, a, just, a, I'm, you don't even know. I just, I would say mm -hmm. this and then you can go do what you want. I mm -hmm. just can't imagine. Uh, but go ahead, yeah. I, you get y'all get it, y'all get it. That's I just can't. That extra time is just crazy. Yeah. So initially, like initially, like niggas didn't think it was gonna be nothing because I like I had like had eight eight crime ease. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So a riot ended up, ended up happening. You know what I'm saying? They alleged allegedly, you know, mm. nigga put somebody to bed and you know what I'm saying got on top of them and started assaulting them. Allegedly, like you mm. feel me? That's what they said. I, I, that I yeah, did allegedly, over that, right. Yeah, mm -hmm. I did or whatever the case is. So. When that happened, a riot break out. This this was between, you know what I'm saying, um, the Asian community, the other community, you know what I'm saying, and the black. So you already know, you know, once that go up, the whole day room and rub. Mm -hmm. So it was pretty much, it was a feeding frenzy on niggas, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So you know, if you out, that's just like even on the streets, if you out the whole riot, everybody's stepping on your right. face. Exactly. So my crimees, out of the, my crimees, majority of my crimees took a deal. They, they took a deal. But I'm so calm, like, nigga, y'all got me, f nigga, you know what I'm saying? Eight people, yeah. At the time, at the time, Arizona was probably trying to prosecute me. They offered me three years. And I'm like, nigga, I'm not taking no th three years for what? You know what I'm saying? So everybody else, like, I'm out. I'm, I'm it was camera or just, oh, okay. Was, but 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 the, suppose the person who they were saying was me. You can't really. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, nigga, you know, nigga I, I ain't even do nothing. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't even do nothing. So long story short, everybody ended up copping the deal. And he, even the police in um, Arizona, they're like, man, take the deal. Bingham, take the deal. 
take the deal. This is not California. Everybody take deals out here. I'm telling you right now, take the deal. I'm like, nigga, I'm going to the box. I'm thinking, I'm thinking it's like California. You ain't got no witness or nothing, nothing because of the victim. Never cooperated whatsoever. Not, never, never cooperated. Was in a coma for, you know what I'm saying, what, 22 days? Damn. Yeah. Uh, they uh, they almost thought it was going to be a homicide, you know what I'm saying? All present to the most side that it wasn't. Yeah, but man. he ended he up waking up or whatever the case is. Never cooperated no nothing. So I'm like, they ain't got no witness, no nothing. I'm going. Man, I went, nigga, in three days. Nigga, guilty. All, all, all towards the day. And then the judge, like, even showed me some love. They was trying to give me 14, bro. They was trying to, they used my California strikes against me. All I comment, I'm a two-time loser out here. So they used my California strikes against me. All I did, which, which they weren't supposed to do. But this is the crazy part about it. I was fighting the case, bro, like two years. If I would have took the three, it would have been a time mm -hmm. served, Spider. So you had the double layer of sickness Ooh, yeah i think about that every day like bro if i would have you know, i got a lawsuit against them anyway but like, like, I, I, good luck it, on that yeah if i would have if i would have took the deal bro yeah, if you got a lawsuit you don't want to speak too much on it then because then this could be used mm. against you if you're someone yeah i never does already. that so he must be serious yeah all right all right that's a fact yeah, he hates yeah. it because he's going to cut that out yeah all right that's fine that's that's cool <laughs> but yeah um i definitely yeah i'm definitely going um seeking damages on that but. absolutely yeah, but I, uh, cause you know, so many of our our kind of get um, fucked over by the system, and we mm -hmm. just take it, accept it. Mm -hmm. and when somebody finally tries to strike back, and we see it be successful, it's a reminder that we don't have to sit down and just take that shit. Yeah, that's a fact. Yeah. But yeah, that 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 it killed me. It killed me, bro. So I I did a, I ended up doing off the A. I ended up doing six more years, so an extra six years, bro. An extra six years, bro. I was supposed to pro twenty seventeen, bro. I didn't get out to twenty twenty three. Man, oh man, oh man. I, I could tell I heard this before, but it's hitting me just as hard as it did. Oh. The first time, cause I, I, I remember being in prison yeah. and catching a, 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 I was smoking weed in my cell and me and Poupe from Grape, the police came in there and popped in on this whoop. I remember they, I got found, they went and made me test and my test was dirty. Oh, they did UA? UA. Yeah. But instead of charging me with um, being under the influence, they charged me with possession. Yeah. And I knew that was the wrong write up, but they gave me like a class B. I couldn't get my time back. They gave me like yeah. six months. I yeah, swear. Yeah, I was like yeah. 30 days to the house. So, oh, uh, yeah. I swear to God, I'm doing. I, 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 Grievances. Yep. Yeah. They denied me first yeah, level, yeah. denied me second level, but I wouldn't because I just, I, I'm reading what it state. Mm -hmm. You, it's it's wrong. I know they wrong. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. I, I, I went all the way to Sacramento. So now I'm past my parole date. Yeah. And I'm kind of like accepting I'm gonna do this little extra time. And yeah. One day the, the, the legal mail came, that motherfucker, I, it was like a thick thing. Yeah, just, there was a little white envelope with the, white the, envelope. With the green, with the green, yeah, 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 and that, yeah. that last page yeah. said, it's just gonna say denied or granted. Yeah. That motherfucker said granted? I say, oh, I beat the motherfucking CDC, what? Man, it released me immediately. I thought I was gonna go home that night, it took like three days. I'm talking about mm -hmm. catching the warden on the yards, mm -hmm. like what? Yeah, yeah, really? like everybody, hey, what my brother? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Got, yeah, yeah. It took about three, four days to get me right, but I got up out of there. So I know, man. Yeah. I was a couple months extended, yeah. six years extended. Six my years. salute, my nigga. I know it took some fortitude yeah. to stay down and not just. Yeah, but you know, no, I was, I was going crazy. I ain't gonna lie. So I, I came man. into the truth. I ain't gonna lie. I was out there going crazy, mm -hmm. going crazy. Everything I'm involved in, everything I'm strapped up, laced up, nigga. It, it is what it is. Nigga, feel like he got life at that point. I get it. You talking about me starting a whole nother? I only, I only came with six. Mm -hmm. I had to do another six. So you basically tell me I got to the end of the road. I got to the end of the road, and I got to start all over again. That's like, that's like a nigga hitting, hitting go. You know when you, when you play Monopoly, that, you know, and yeah, you go, yeah. you hit the little thing, you, 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 you ain't got no money again. Yeah, you ain't you won't get no two hundred. You, you yeah. remind me of the Bible. Who was that that went to marry the wanted to marry the man's daughter? And he said, "Okay, you want to marry my daughter? Go yeah. work seven years in my yeah. field, and then you can marry." And he went to the wedding, and pulled the veil off. It was the yeah. wrong lady. Yeah, and he loved her so much, he went and worked seven more years seven in the more field. Years. God love. damn. Yeah, but I um, it's it's gonna be crazy when people hear me say this, but um. Uh, I'm kind of I'm kind of glad I did I did an extra six years, bro. Mm, I, can, I I didn't even go I didn't, I didn't for more for as far as my kids wise, you know I missed six more years of their life, but they understand you know um you know later later down in life I just know my path the path that I was on you know the hatred I had in my heart you know I, I wouldn't have made it out here, bro. Mm. I would I would have even came back with life where somebody's gonna kill me in the streets, bro. I, I ain't gonna lie because I had hatred in my heart. 
You know, and then it's like I found, even though I, I miss time, they, they say you got to sacrifice something. I miss time with my kids and stuff like that, time on the streets. And, you know, unfortunately, I, I wasn't able to see my mom again, like in person, but I wouldn't have been here, bro. Yeah, had I got out, had I got out in 2007, 20, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have been. Here. I know it's for a fact, bro. I know it's for a fact, bro. So that, I, I, honestly, that time was like was well spent in my personal opinion because I found so much more, like you know what I'm saying, including myself and my true identity. You know, so I felt like it was all a part of God's plan. I really, I really feel that way, bro, because I wouldn't. Pff, yeah. It takes a man that has really found some resolution with life to come to that type of understanding, yeah. bro. That's yeah. deep. I needed it, bro. I ain't gonna lie, cause it broke my back, Spider. Yeah. That six broke me. Now, now, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I would've got out there, like, I ain't, nigga, psh, right. you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I, nigga, I, yeah. I'm still young, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Now, it's like, nigga, I'm old, bro. Like, I ain't, I don't, I don't wanna see a jail cell, bro. If it ain't for me defending myself, you know what I'm saying? I don't wanna see another jail cell, bro, ever. That's what I'm I don't on. never wanna go back, bro. That's I, what I, I'm it, on. It broke my back, like, I'm cool on this jail shit, I'm cool, like, I, like it go back to even saying, like, even experiencing when I'm thinking, what what's 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 being gangster? Oh, going to YA, going to camp, nigga hitting the pen, doing this, this, and the third. You get what I'm saying? Like, nigga, they ain't gangster. You missing out. This shit sucking here. Can't afford to go to jail. Them niggas losing out. Man, they they losing out, bro. I gotta take a <laughs> shit. I gotta take a shit with my cellie in here. Lockdowns, bro. And, and just oh. imagine how uncomfortable it used to be on, bro. and how used to it you get. Yeah. To where you don't even think about it no more. Just. Now he talking yeah. to you. Yeah, exactly. All that. Yeah. It ain't nothing. That's what, but yeah. both everybody, like, everybody gets that comfortable. Like, yeah. bro, this shit ain't normal, bro. Not normal. It ain't normal. Nah. I, I be, I be finding myself like even people just looking. I catch people. So I'm like, I love, I love. You know what I'm saying? I, right. I got like, damn. Yeah. Like, I'm, like, you know what I'm saying? It's like yeah. a lot. It's not necessary. Now I'm institutionalized. I'm trained to to be observant of everything, and I'm just. You know, it's like, mm -hmm. nah, bro, like, mm -hmm. nah, that's the hell, no, I'll never trade, nigga, I'm, I'm tired of Top Ramen, I'm tired of soups, you know, I'm, all that shit, bro, like, fighting the Mexicans. What's nah, your favorite restaurant? I ain't got a, I ain't got a favorite restaurant fast right now, Fast food, bro. I don't eat a lot of fast food, bro. I mean, so, unfortunately, sometimes. practice sometime, one meal a day? Is that part of your practices, one meal a day? No, I eat one, I eat one, one meal a day, but it's not, you don't have to eat, but I fast okay. on the weekend for the Sabbath, you know, Friday night to Saturday night. Oh, then I was raised, that's, you just said, wow, Sabbath, huh? Yeah, the Sabbath. Oh, because Marvelous talked about that too. Remember Marvelous Inc. Yeah, Marvelous Inc. Yeah. yeah. So being a Hebrew, Hebrew, Hebrew Israelite, uh -huh. from my understanding, it's less black like the Muslims and more colored to include the Latins as an equal within their heritage. And yeah. Do you, can you expound on that or because I had a guest, Mar shout out to Marvelous Inc. He's mm -hmm. also a Hebrew Israelite. Mm -hmm. So he was speaking as to how the black and brown gap is bridged. I don't like to use that term because people, but just to mention both groups are equally under that umbrella to a certain extent or no. Yeah. Um, it's, it's certain, you know, even though I'm Hebrew Israelite, it's different type of, you know what I'm saying, ideologies, you know what I'm saying, and doctrines that's, that's, press, um, that's pushed, you know what I'm saying? Right. But my personal, my personal beliefs, you know what I'm saying, it's, it's, well, it's not my personal belief, it is, it's 12 tribes of Israel. Mm -hmm. Whatever one is your father, whether it's, you know, um, you know, 12 tribes, Levi or whatever, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying, Judah or whatever, whatever you, whoever you feel your father is, 12 tribes of Israel, them are real ch children of Israel. So if you fall under that, which the, you know, the, um, I'm gonna say the Hispanics, but majority of them, as far as like Mexicans, natives and all that, you know what I'm saying, they fall up under that, sure. you know, so, they be they really we all the same people. You get what I say. So you gotta understand. So you gotta understand. Everything come from black, bro. You know it's different. So I can get deeper. So it's so it's different type of bloodlines and 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 people who's not of God's people who they believe they are. But if you really are a part of that twelve tribes of Israel, then for sure you 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 know you God's people. We all we all the same people. We all under that umbrella as well. But yeah, a lot not a lot of um you know not a lot of. Uh, uh, I'm gonna say Mexicans know that they they are people. You know that that's why they they're gonna say the Catholic or you know they even to you know what I'm saying the Christians or whatever the case is. But a lot of people and this and, and it's crazy that you said that, that, that. This is a good thing that he said that will fuck me up. See that's why I'm saying like I needed that six years, bro, mm. because I learned so much. So a person you asked go me, far, homie. yeah, li li listen, you a person can accept that type of shit and yeah, really I, grab you. Gonna go bro, far. I'm listening. I, 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 I used to thought I, I used to think I was smart, but I was stupid as a motherfucker, yeah. like dumb as a motherfucker. I really didn't know shit. So a person asked me this question. He say, look. So I'm gonna ask you the question. I'm gonna say I'm gonna ask you the same question he asked me, and I'm gonna see if you get it or not. How many how many races is it? 
how many in your in your estimating like your ex expert opinion, yo, how many races would you say it is? Because you asking me like this and all that, I'm gonna say one. Okay. You 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 yeah, did you you, you 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 did a lot better than I did. Okay. So when a person asked me that question, how many races is it? I said, man, shit, it's hundreds of races. I would have said something like that. Yeah, if, without yeah, the yeah. setup, exactly. I would have said 15, so, so 30 or something. He, 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 three. He, he, he got it right. Oh, he do. He, okay. he, he, he got it, he got it right. So it's only three races. This thing is a college graduate. He yeah, knew this shit so, for real. So, so I, I grew here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Black, well, I was oh, saying okay. black, white, you know what I'm saying, and Asian. Uh, it's only three races, races but I knew that, black. but I didn't know that, but I knew that, yeah. A, okay. a lot of people, they're gonna say hundreds, so mm -hmm. a person, and this was a brother, had teeth, he said, he said, Turtle, it's the difference between a race and a nationality, bro. Mm. I didn't know that, bro. I'm gonna just keep it a buck until that day, and I'm, I'm man enough to like, bro, I was I was illiterate, I'm like, what the fuck you mean, Turtle, nationality? He said, bro, black, I mean, um, Mexican, Puerto Rican, all that, all that shit is a nationality, bro. All that shit comes from them. Uh, 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 um, and then it, it fucked me up. I knew this, but he, when he was saying, he was like, you know how, to, and a lot of Mexicans, they don't want to accept this too, but this is facts. <laughs> this is this is facts. You know how the Mexican race- Real devil, when you coming through, man, shout out to the haters world, man. You yeah, said yeah. too much. How, 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 down, how, down. Yeah, how the Mexicans came about, about is a native in a, in a Spaniard. That's why they speak Spanish. Mm. Not a lot of them want to accept that they got white in their blood, and that's a fact. Mm. That is a fact. You know what I'm talking. That is a fact. They the, 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 the Spaniards raped the Native American women, and that's how the Mexicans. You know what I'm saying? They saw oh, we Aztecs and all that. Yeah, that's that's the Native American. They, that's Asian. Yeah. I mean, if you're Aztecs or Latin. Exactly. It's exactly. You know what I'm saying? And that's how they. You know they came off. So they have. You know. Okay. That's interesting. That's a fact. I, I, I'm very careful about discussing the Latin culture online at this point because mm. a, a weirdo from their community tried to, he's yeah. somewhat from their community, tried to put me in a trick bag. So yeah. I'm trying to well, be very I, careful why, why, why I choose my well, word. I, I speak on it openly. You no, know, I, I do know. as well, but. Yeah, so so with me, I go off biblical facts and scientific, scientific facts. But you've already stated that they're, yeah. in, you include them into your spiritual brotherhood. So yeah, it's they're not part, like, they're yeah. part of the 12 tribes so of Israel. Facts, whether facts, whether yeah. they want to accept that or not, they're part of the 12 tribes of Israel. We all the same people, bro. Mm -hmm. And that would include everyone in the Caribbean, right? Most Caribbean Yeah, Caribbean. yeah because they all Africans. Yeah. Yeah. The Caribbeans, all they, they were just the Spaniards who's maiden with them. Exactly. Or, or you know, the Asian, that, exactly. I have, absolutely, those are brothers. I have a, I have a feeling you're going to be invited back here outside of me, bro. <laughs> Yeah, he don't never do this, bro. He just jumped in yeah. the whole interview. <laughs> yeah, man, I, pre I appreciate it. I mean, I yes, just feel sir. like it's, it's like I got a whole, I got a whole another side to me. And, you know, this this the side that I want to light, and I appreciate you and him for inviting me on the platform. Peep it though. So, Even when you was pushing yeah. the line with all the, I, I told yeah. you soon. I talked to you. I see the other yeah. shit. I want to help you expose the other shit, but I yeah. salute the other shit because yeah. I know that's us and what we. Yeah. yeah. But Come we trying to do something bigger, and you have what it take, bro. Um, let these people know where they can keep up with you on your social media, your platforms, and all that. Man, absolutely, man. Everything right now, Spotty Face underscore S P O E T Y F A C E underscore. Man, I'm on pretty much all the major platforms: TikTok, Instagram, Thread, Facebook, and YouTube. Man, help me get my um my YouTube page back cracking, man. You know they they shut me down. Do we ever get to the bottom of the source? Because I I seen some content that seems to indicate. And I believe, I talk to Brick all the time. And if he would have did it, he would have been telling me like, yeah, nigga shouldn't have fucked with me, cuz. But his thing is, cuz I don't even know how to, how a nigga think, I don't really think he did it. He has a following that may have mass reported certain shit, but outside of us being suspicious that he did it, any other leads you think might have been responsible? You still think that's the only thing you got in your heart? Man, nah, it's, it's listen, I, I'm gonna say it like this, bro. Um, I was gaining some traction. I was gaining some momentum, man. I just feel like, man, it was, it was, it was, it was, it was the most high humbling me. There you, ooh. You taking the wrong approach. I don't want you. I, I don't. I don't. I don't want you to. I don't want you to do that. You this might be land. going for the best guest award around this motherfucker yeah, so do. far, homie. That was so fucking unexpectedly hum humble. Yeah, I take it with a grain of sand, man. I, I, I was, I was getting, the, I was getting the recognition for the wrong reason. That's not what he wanted me to get it for. He All right, me to now, Brick, I'm gonna do what you asked me to do. I wasn't gonna do it till now, because his message was. Just don't try to ride me on into the thing. Whatever it is, don't ride me. And now here you are saying riding him was the wrong decision. 
But I, I wasn't I, gonna, I, I, I wasn't gonna say that on his behalf. I was gonna listen, leave it alone. Listen, listen. I, I don't. I want to correct that because I was never riding, dude. Okay. So that, that, that's a, that, that. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that's a, that's a false that's a false false narrative. But I'm not gonna jump out on the window. With, okay. I mean, but I can't see how it's percepted. Okay. As a, so I, listen, I'm gonna be hundred percent transparent. My whole thing is about I was never chasing clout. Anybody know who? Anybody know me in the streets of LA? Like I'm I'm that. Like I I, I don't I don't Indeed. need that. Like you know what I'm saying? So my community, like I'm that. But my whole thing is, is as far as with the homie, he said like it was. I made a video, just just venting. You know what I'm saying? Just I got upset. I got I got in my feelings or whatever, and I, I was venting. And I woke up the next morning, and the shit was viral. I didn't try to. You know what I'm saying? Like oh, nigga, I ain't, you know what I'm saying? If I <laughs> listen, anybody who know me, if I wanted to be viral, bro, I would have been with four extras every day. Every time right. I, I, nah, I don't want to go to that. That's so lame, bro. Right. All these, I went to maybe like one or two of my of my cousin. You know what I'm saying? Interviews. I was always the person like I'm. That's his way. If I wanted to be, I could have been doing something with him. I could have been doing something with DJ. I could have been doing something with Lupe. I didn't want to stay offer me them. Them interviews, I turned down. He took them. Mm. Mm. I turned them down. Like, nah, bro, I'm cool on that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, me and him got out two days apart from each other. I, I, I wasn't even, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't trying to get it like that. It just, like, most people say, like, they go viral. Or, I, I didn't expect this. I, yes. I was, th you know what I'm saying? Organic, so, yes. Yeah, so I wasn't never trying to ride his wave. Like, you know what I'm saying? If he feel that way, I, it's understandable. I'm not going to get mad at him. Man. It is what it is, man. Shout out to Brick, baby, man. Yeah, like, like, to the neighborhood. Appreciate you, you know what I mean? Yeah. I, I know all the controversy it's, people said they want, it's but one Brick, more thing. It's one more thing before we conclude. I want okay. I want to clear the air, air with it. I said on another platform, but, you know, I want I to say it again. But you could go ahead and ask the question. I'm just letting you know, though. No, I, I forgot what I was finna say because I thought you was finna land something solid. I blanked it out of my brain. I don't know. I was finna tell Brick, though, I support you. I'm proud of you, all the shit you do because I know you got a gang of pressure on you, on your back, but you is sitting in a seat that is coveted. It is favored, bro. Don't let this pressure make you crash out and do no extra shit that's unnecessary, bro. Stay solid. Shit gonna come full circle for you, homie. Don't trip. The real ones is here. Cuz had a valid point. He corrected his approach. His points still are valid, and now the dialogue has been had, and, and real men have an understanding now, and that's all we about, man. That's it. If you want to land something else, I was done. Yeah, I want to. I want to. I want to piggyback off that as far as the break. My my. But I want. I got one more issue too. Okay. But as far as to the homie break, it, it piggybacking off that's like nigga. This this is an opportunity right here, bro. Like I don't care about none of that other shit that Klaus said or none. At the end of the day, we black men, bro. We men. Let's show the youth. Let's show the people how two people can agree to disagree. You don't have to go no further, bro. There I don't go. care about with the comments, bro. I don't care about when they oh he went out. He he call him this. He call him that and all this that and the third. Let's show people. You know what I'm saying that how how it can be resolved in a different way other than violence. I salute that facts with feelings episode 33 has come to a conclusion that music you hear playing is produced by my brother rest in peace rare rest tarzan the puto i've been having this um instrumental for a couple of years that's uh trey legend on the hook and i've been trying to think what i was gonna write this song about the reality check trey legend came with that concept so i have been trying to force the song about my nine to five job at the docks, I thought that was gonna be fly. So I couldn't quite write the song. But since Puto has passed, I have began writing it. So this is gonna be a record being dedicated to Puto because losing him was one of the, if not the biggest reality check I ever had in my life. Mm -hmm. Love you Puto, GIP. See you when I get there. Tell Nip I said, night bug. Rest in peace, baby nut. Level six kitchen, love you bro.